Hello, welcome to the Skyrim yeah. Lads. I'm here with Darren. Yes, that's me. Uh, Darren, now an official member of the Skyrim Lads. I've even got my official name, Alval Uvani. Alval for short. That's nice. Um, Darren, you're going to uh, give us some important inf information on this quest we're about to do. Uh, can you give us some uh, information? No, no, no. I sure can, Thom. Uh, basically, what we're going to do is we're going to use a shout that we previously learned in our last video to call a dragon. No, no, don't go that way. Go to the end. I think... Oh, sorry, technical defeat. You press... Uh, quest. Go on your quests. Uh, yes, you've got loads of quests active. Only unactive eight, all of them. This can be a common mistake, except the top one. The top one's fine. Okay, now let's get off the menu. Okay, the feet. Now that has gone. All right. Now I want you to shout. Use the shout that we learned, and then the dragon should arrive. Okay. Now there's a trap that most people fall into on this one. That is that they call the dragon, then keep trying to kill it. What you want to do is lure. What you want to do is lure them into, in, lure it into the trap, which is at the back. Okay. So, so I'll show you. I'll show you when it comes, okay? Now call it. Oops! Oh, oh, I'm quite scared then. I was too, Tom, but you just gotta remain calm. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes, it's gonna come. You can see it moving on the quest. We're just going to watch him subdue it. Now, uh, a tip here is to use the dragon wren shout to bring him to the ground and then walk backwards and he will follow you. So that's what we're going to do. There we go, now they should, they've sprung the trap. And that's as simple as that, that's how you trap a dragon. He'll be fine, now we're just going to have a little chat with him, and then he's going to take you off. Sothengar! To Ubonar, you went to a great deal of trouble to put me in this humiliating position. <laughs> in Seer Alduin, hmm? No doubt you want to know enjoy. where to find Alduin. Renik Vaza, an apt phrase. Alduin, Boval. One reason I came to your call was to test your thum for myself. Many of us have begun to question Alduin's lordship, whether his thum was truly the strongest. Among ourselves, of course, Muni Maie, none were yet ready to openly defy him. Some white chocolate. <laughs> Once Lord Croesus, innumerable pardons, I digress. He has traveled to Sovngarde to regain his strength. Devouring the Silasure, the souls of the mortal dead, a privilege he jealously guards. His door to Sovereign Guard is at Skaldafin, one of his ancient fanes high in the eastern mountains. Binduran pa ok midore navarantil. I surely do not need to warn you that all his remaining strength is marshaled there. Zu lost Ofan Hinlan. Now that I have answered your question, 
You will allow me to go free? Um? Serve you? No. Need id. If and when you defeat Alduin, I will reconsider. Hmm, Krosis. There is one detail about Skaldofen I neglected to mention. Only this. You have the Thurm of Adova, but without the wings of one, you will never set so foot to Skaldafen. Of course, once you've flown, Amadeev. And we're off and away!